Damn, all this playing and I've only recorded 36 minutes of footage, according to my camera. Close the door, no, it doesn't seem to do anything. Guys just appear. Documents. Uh, okay, this is just like a death certificate. I hereby certify that I attended deceased from June 4th, 2003 to February 28th, 2009. I saw him alive on February 27th, 2009. That death occurred on the date stated above at 4 11 a.m. Principal cause of death and related causes of importance were as follows. Heart failure due to advanced age. This is to certify that this is a true and correct copy of the official record. So we got undead people walking around. Those are my footsteps. I thought I heard some guy walking. Oh, they got a shitter on this chair? <laughs> wow. At least they were kind enough to do that. I did not have a good day. Am I missing something in here? I don't think so. I just came from there. I don't have to have the night vision on all the time. That's pretty much what I like using the camera for, though. It wastes battery, just. Because, but you kind of try to record stuff. <laughs> no, that's not good. I'm getting here. In here? It's one of those big guys. Yeah, I gotta get out of here. Oh, fuck. Fuck me, man. Is that supposed to happen? Oh, thank God that was here. Jesus. Yeah, I could see wanting to go to the shower after landing in that. Why did it just get dark all of a sudden? Was oh, this where I was earlier? It was. Man, that was a lot of bodies. Okay, if you zoom in, you can see further into the darkness. That's good. I like my guy's natural night vision.
shit. See him. This is freaking me out. There he is. the best time to run out there is. See me, man. I think I'm good. I hope so. Stairs now? I can't tell. <laughs> I don't think they'd be giving you all these beds to hide under if it was for no reason. Close the door. <laughs> I'm surprised I can't see the light from the screen. Okay, now I got another guy I gotta, gotta get by. Down. 
No, he's right there. Gotta get by when he's in that room, but that's the only room I can go into is the one he's in. Try here. I'm gonna try this. God damn. And I could have just went this way the whole goddamn time. Son of a bitch. I could have. This way. Have I been here yet? I think I have. Showers. Locked. Oh, Jesus. Why you gotta be scaring me like that, man? Jesus, fuck. Oh, this with guy got his head ripped off. I don't think this is the place I want to be. Uh, that's rather unsettling. Okay. Who's that guy, that guy from Soul Calibur? What the hell's his name? He's kind of following me. Look at guy. Saying something? We got stairs going up. No way to get up there. And this guy following me. I don't like that. See anywhere to go in here? That has to be where I have to go. Whoa. Right there. Nope. 
Just another cell. Fuck. Oh, I see. Clean you right up, buddy. <laughs> oh, that guy's not pissing. Whoa, get out of here, man. I'm shaking. job. Finally killed somebody in this game. Oh, my last battery after this. This guy's trying to grab me, right? What's the experiment? The dead will perform on the living. I think I hit. It's still happening. The experiment is still happening. I think the camera just disappears. He's both hands. Not kill his enemies. Witness. Documents. Rudolf G. Wernick. Dr. Rudolf G. Wernick, age 90, passed away doing doing the work he loved on February 28, 2009. He was born in 1918 in Munich, Germany. In chief fame in the mathematic and scientific communities for a paper written with early computing pioneer Alan Turing. After a cloudy history with the German war effort, he immigrated to the United States in 1949 with a visa from the State Department. Several decades of government research in the Los Alamos led to New Mexico, where Dr. Wernick retired to pursue landscape photography and care for his cats. Crazy cat man. He came to Colorado shortly after the turn of the millennium to pursue charitable work for the Murkoff Corporation. A statement from the company calls Dr. Wernick a true humanitarian with a generous spirit. He leaves no survivors. Oh, yeah. Fuck survivors. Some batteries. Can I go over here? I can go up. This is inactive. Okay. Oops. Whoa. That guy disappeared. Better. Good. Are they gonna punch me? Yep. Oh, that guy's taking my bed. I think that guy punched me just because I was in his room. Maybe not. Yep, I s knew that was gonna fucking happen. I knew that was gonna happen, man. These assholes would grab me. Motherfucker. She's hiding. It's always the sound, too. The jump scare sound. <laughs> Guess that's where I gotta go. Follow the blood. Anything over here first? Like a battery or something? Yep. 
Never go where you're supposed to go right away. Wow, I don't like that. Big black hallway. Uh, what's down here? Let's go the non-bloody way. Okay, I got lockers to hide in. Oh, that is brutal. The word Wall Rider is all over this place. Murkoff is running an experiment here called Project Wall Rider. But the patients talk about the Wall Rider like it's a physical presence. A spirit or a demon. Something they found in the mountain. I chalk it up to schizophrenic delusion, but I just saw something. Maybe. Maybe it was a glitch in the camera. Or maybe this place is getting to me. Did I see something? I don't remember seeing anything. <laughs> fuck this place. Seriously, just fuck this place. Dying keeps going. Moving lower on the list of the worst things that could happen to me here. I haven't looked at any of these. Crowd of broken men watching a dead channel. They look like patients. It probably never happened. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not I'll, I'll read these from now on, but the old ones might not bother. Okay. So, what is there fucking ghosts now? Next thing I gotta worry about is something I can't see. It's not a good feeling. that. Let's throw batteries in some weird places in here. <sighs> Big hole in the ground. Yeah, let's go there. Can I turn this? And I really like this game. Is that a sheet or is that a ghost? Find a way out of the sewers. Anything over here? No. No batteries? I guess I gotta go that way. Yep. That's not a bad reason. Nope. <coughs> this way. Is this guy not dead? The hell, he's like in the bars? That was intentional. Oh, I just saw that. What the fuck was that? Man, fuck this place. Yeah, I got ghost to worry about now. Found scrawled in pencil on the back of an admittance form. Handwriting. Handwriting matches sample from patient's father. Martin Archambaud. This god is real. What we've mistaken so f so long for ghosts, spirits, madness. We were only willingly ignorant. The scales on Saul's eyes were fear, and when you see beyond it, you truly see. This is the gift of the wall rider, the gospel of sand. The greatest sin in the world is willful ignorance of God, to receive a re revelation and not spread it to the waiting flock. This place, to stand in the way of salvation, is a sin for which there is no punishment too great. 
Oh man. Fuck this place, I agree with my guy. Is there something in that? Not see me, guy. <laughs> so loud. Can I pick that up. Drain valve. Here's one. Batteries in here first. Something be standing there. Fuck, that'd be scary. Decided yes. Now come pick the wrong locker. Oh my god, they don't always pick the wrong locker. What? Oh shit. Fuck me. I thought they always picked the wrong goddamn locker. Guess I was wrong. Can you even get through here? Fuck barricade! Wow. I thought they always picked the wrong locker. I guess I was lucky all those times. Lower junction. Do I have to go down there? Wonder. Keep going, guy. Fuck. 